Hey what's up guys, it's Mike with Alpha Reptile back with another video today and today we are Don and Lucas's doing a frog room tour. I guess it's a frog basement at this point. Right? The frog house? <laughs> yeah, the frog house. Yeah, it's stay tuned. 500 frogs coming your way. Let's go. Yeah. Behind us is some of our Ranatomea of the tiny thumbnail frogs, no bigger than the size of your thumbnail. In fact, some of the ones we have are even smaller. They're no bigger than my picky nail. Over here, we have a few of the different tanks. Uh, we're gonna have our Chizudas, Torpados. There's some lowland Fantasticas on this row. We also have in the top tanks, some of our young uh, Felsuma Clemmeri that are growing up, almost ready to find new homes. In this tank here, this is one of our early tanks that we built back in 2012, and this has some Amiriga bacilli in it. And continuing on with our Ranatomea, we have even more on this side of the rack. As we move down the rack, we start going into our larger species, the Dendrobates, such as the Tinctoris and the Aratus. Let's check out some of these frogs. Yeah. Dawn and dusk. So these are Azurius. Yeah. And their cousin, typical rivers, right beside them. New rivers are right beside them. Yeah. And this is the summer guy enclosure. And if we spin around, we have even more Tinctoris on this rack right here. These are Oyopox here and here. We have um, Azurus here. Some young yellowbacks were growing out. So in here are some cobalt tinctoris, and this tank is one of my favorite, the green sipawani. <laughs> no, sipawani. <laughs> what? Sipawani? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I could be wrong, but I've never heard them pronounce anything else. <laughs> we yep. continue down the line, we have some of our citronella frogs, um, powder blue. We have some young cobalts and our lafumes. Powder blues. This little guy's taking his daily bath. 
If you want to see some more of these frogs, Mike's done an amazing video of us feeding 500 dart frogs this entire room. Link is below or in the cards. And if you like what you've seen here, check out some of the other videos we've done with Mike in the past and in the future. Make sure to hit that like button, ding that bell, and subscribe. We'll continue on. We have an entire section dedicated to the Robertus, but also below them is all of our Afaga species. That's a Punta Lara? Yes. Yeah. And down there we have a bunch of babies. Some of the newer tinctoris we have are the Brazilian yellowheads. Beside him is the Katori River. So over here is where we keep all of our uh, fruit flies and the tadpoles. So in order to feed 500 dart frogs, you need an army of fruit flies to feed them all. This is where we keep them. And behind me, we have all our different tadpoles from the Tinctoris, the Erratus, and even the small thumbnail frogs. We've found quite a bit of success keeping the Dendrobates, the Leucamellas, and the Erratus uh, communally in these uh, uh, shoebox sized containers. Some of our glass frog tadpoles. Look at these little guys taking a little daytime snack. After a few months, those tadpoles have hatched out and they've turned into froglets where we're going to start to raise them in these boxes here until they're old enough to go into their permanent home. And I believe there is a couple more large tanks that we need to check out. You bet. Let's go take a look at some of the larger tanks where we have Amiriga. And let's not forget about the Boana picturata. So in this tank here is our Boana picturatas. Now they are nocturnal frogs so they're sleeping right now. Uh, this tank is over 40 inches wide and 40 inches tall, so it's a fairly large enclosure for them. In this enclosure, we keep our Amerigo Silverstonii. Behind me is where we keep some of our nocturnal species, including our cinnamon tree frogs, fringe leaf frogs, and everybody's favorite, the glass frogs. All right, you guys, and that concludes the tour, the kind of walkthrough, I suppose, of Jungle Jewel Exotics frog basement, amphibian basement. Frog house. <laughs> yeah, frog house at this point. They got plants upstairs, frogs downstairs. Where do you guys sleep? 
<laughs> we do have a bedroom. Oh. Yeah. And no frogs allowed. Uh, there's no reports of this bedroom. I've never seen it, so who knows. <laughs> I want to thank Jungle Jewel for having me out here and filming all these videos for you guys. If you guys want to support them, please do. They're an incredible business and great people that I love and I call my friends. Make sure to check them out on Instagram, Facebook, Google Jungle Jewel Exotics, and they'll pretty much pop up anywhere you look. Well, I want to thank you guys very much for watching. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, anything like that, leave them in the comment section down below. If you you guys want to see more make sure you click subscribe and we'll catch you in the next video later